In today's news, a school in Norway is the first in the world to pioneer circadian lighting. India will switch all its streetlights to LEDs, and the world's first connected bus shelter is unveiled. Lux Today for Wednesday, September 9th starts in just a moment. Stick around. Hello and welcome to Lux Today for September 9th. I'm Courtney Ferguson. A school in Norway is pioneering groundbreaking circadian lighting in an attempt to improve pupils' well-being and their academic performance. The lighting at the new Kongsgardmoen School in Kongsberg varies throughout the day in intensity and in color. In the morning, it greets the 231 pupils with a strong, cool white light. And during the rest of the day, it changes to set the pupils' daily rhythms. Scientists are following the experiment closely to see if the so-called tunable lighting can change school children's behavior and improve exam results. Also changing the lights is the Government of India, which has announced that it will replace all its street lights with LED sources over the next two years. The transformation will be achieved by a mixture of lamp replacement and the installation of new LED fixtures. The move is part of a plan to reduce energy demand and take pressure off the country's ailing power system. What's being billed as the world's first connected bus shelter has been unveiled in Sydney, Australia. The bus stop in the busy suburb of Newtown has been turned into a dynamic, interactive light and sound experience. It features an interactive panel display where visitors can create a unique lighting experience. They can select from different music genres and synchronize with 24 Wi-Fi connected Philips Hue lamps. The shelter was given the high-tech treatment to promote connected lighting in Australia. That wraps things up for us today, but remember you can get all the latest lighting news globally, 24 hours a day at LuxReview.com. I'm Courtney Ferguson for Lux Today. We'll see you back here at the same time next Wednesday.